And then make sure you guys get a bunch of cargo pants. Just get neutral colors. Please go to Google. Type in like Baby, stop. Okay, I want to be their Google today. Like, just stop being annoying. So back to you guys. Anyone else grew up obsessed with this? It came in the big, big circular box though. Babe, you wanna try this? Yep. Can you like focus on me and yeah, yes. Quality Street? Yes. Because he actually never had those growing up. What a rough childhood. So I'm gonna have him try, try this. It was my favorite. Yes. Why not? This, 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 this. this. Yes. This one. Babe. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. Good. What are you doing? It's very good. <laughs> try this. No, 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 it's good. Please try, try, try it. We would try, try it. Try it. <laughs> Can you try it? Is it the kind of cargo? No, no. Just take me a shape back. I'm gonna do a heavy bill to the bar. Try it. Be nice. Should I? Yeah. In the dust. Mm. It's so good. I don't know what he's talking about. One day traveling to get to Africa is finally done. Not yet. We have one more flight. What do you mean we have one more flight? Well, not today. Three days. Three days. Yes, finally done. Because I am done flying, you guys. It took an entire day with all the stopping and layover time, but we are finally in Kenya. I mean, I've done it down. It took me an hour to do this. The one it took me a while too, and then I but this one is really big. Hey, buddy. Oh my God, it's so cute. See, just drop it like that. Get the habit. And you come down, so drop it. Okay. And you can pet him too. He's nice. Oh, okay, I can do that. Oh, I'm sorry. Let him put it out first. Yeah, there you go. Okay, okay. Let him put it out. One more. We missed that. And then last one. has been a very interesting trip it's taking us about six hours to get to our hotel um, and it's getting dark it's a tent we're staying in not a hotel we're staying in a this one is a tent thank you Welcome. i need it so bad this place is so cute okay, so this is the room they have a little heart set up for us here so cute. But let us ten, baby. And we're gonna get our feet to get ten. I'm the fun. Honestly, you guys, I'm the worst person to take with you on an the African, like Last an African trip. safari. Like it, it, it's just not me. Like I'm afraid of insects and mosquitoes and ants. Like, how do you think I'm gonna react when I see a lion tomorrow? Are on our first safari. What is it called? Safari. They call it a game, right? Are you going a game to game drive? Game, game drive. Going out to, to the actual jungle. Yeah. So we've seen buffalo, zebras, a hyena, a deer, and giraffe so far. Um, and an interesting fact that our driver just told us: uh, more people are killed by hippos and buffaloes than by lions.
remember those from from the Lion King movie? What are they called? Boons? Baboons. Baboons. Oh, duh. Baboons. Baboons. Hey. Hakuna Mata. Hello. No. Hi. Hey. I'm doing this. I'm on my feet. This is a jungle, right? I'm in a real jungle on my feet right now. They're so pretty, but I wish they can get closer. They don't get closer to here, right? And then here are footprints of the buffaloes and giraffes. So I gave my hubby a hard time yesterday because I was really a very hard time. I almost mosquitoes. put her on the fucking plane and he sent her back. Literally was gonna send me back. But look at me, babe. Aren't you impressed? Your girl's in the middle of the freaking jungle, just walking. Like there isn't any buffaloes around or lions or you know, like I'm putting my life at risk. Back in our resort. This so is the first time I actually get a view during the day because we came back, we came to the hotel yesterday super late so I wasn't able to see much. It's so cute. Okay, you guys, I am getting, what is it called? Braids? Braids, yeah. Braids. I'm getting a full braid right now. I'm so excited. Are you going to use this on my hair? <laughs> yeah, this. How, how many hours does it take? Two hours. Two hours. Uh. All right, let's do this. <laughs> so what is the first step in creating the braid? You have to cut the hair. In cut portion. the hair? In, ah. No, push oh. on the hair. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, no cutting, right? Need to get no cutting. Okay. You can shower with the hair normally, right? Yeah. No, um, don't put water in it. Oh, no water in my hair? Yeah. For how long? One month. What? <laughs> <laughs> can you give me my phone, babe? It's here. She's an Instagram model. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> okay. So she's very actually apparently excited yeah. to do my hair. Yes. Exactly. She's excited because you're the first yeah. white person yeah. she's doing her hair. I'm hair. the first white person yeah. that she's done my hair. Yeah. Wow. I feel so privileged. Me too. <laughs> wow. I'm happy. Aww. So happy. I'm happy I'm doing it. Yeah. <laughs> and she's happy for touching your head too. Aww. And so we were saying this is God's plans because uh, she has never done it and now she's doing it. Oh. She never knew that she would touch a white person's head. <laughs> oh yeah, my yeah. God, you guys, you're going to make me cry. <laughs> to us, we feel so honored. Oh my God, you're so nice. It's really not a big deal, it's a normal head. <laughs> Three in Africa. We're going on another game drive. And then tomorrow we get to check out and go to the river safari. And then hop to another resort because my husband just freaking loves safari adventures, you know? He's not keeping into consideration he has a wife that is terrified from animals and insects. But it's just fun. It is fun actually, but it's just I, I really need to like kind of like get used to it. So I have four more days to kind of take everything in and just become friends with the lions and um, you know all those amazing animals. Um, so we shall see what happens. Last day in this specific area in Kenya, and we are going to go on a river safari right now. So this was the main reason why we stayed in this area for three days is because of the river safari. So we're gonna see a lot of hippos and I don't know what other animals as well. And then we're going on a walking tour right over here to see some other animals. I don't wanna do the walking tour because I'm a bit afraid, but I don't wanna piss the meat off. So I'm trying to act strong, you know what I mean? I'm trying to act tough. Okay, we're done with the river safari and now we're heading to the walking tour we're gonna be walking and seeing a few animals let's see what we actually see I'm trying to act strong here you know 
Are you happy, babe? This has been phenomenal. This is the river safari. Like you'd be in the boat and out of nowhere a hippo pops up. Yeah. This is fucking amazing. Yeah. I'm glad you're enjoying it. <laughs> so here we've got some zebras and the ones next to them are called wild beasts. And apparently, um, as you guys can tell, they're kind of shy. The closer we get to them, they actually start walking away. My husband's gonna show you a demonstration because he's so brave. Okay, babe, hide on. Thank you. You did it for the video. Thank you. I did it for the gram. All right, babe. The camera's right here. So let's 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 talk to the people. What do you want to start with? Well, advice for Africa for those who want to come to Africa one day. Uh, don't bring your wife. <laughs> Things not to bring with you to Africa. <laughs> one, your wife. <laughs> You're making me sound so bad. No, no, no. For, you know, be a good husband and leave her at home. <laughs> you know. No, honestly, you guys, I I, think I, I need to explain myself. Um, Baby, make it, you have a better explanation. Not don't bring them to Africa. Don't bring them to the jungle. Okay? If, they're, if, if they are, okay, let me just be honest with you. It is, no, it is an amazing experience. Like, I actually love getting inside the safari car and going on the game nights and stuff. It's so fun. We saw the rhinos and all these things. I think it's so much fun. I actually got so excited that I even walked the jungle. But the thing that I'm actually afraid of, and please, you guys, don't take it offensively. because I around my face. Hold on. I ha yeah, that means it's focusing on you. He doesn't know much about videos. Um, some people actually took it offensively. Oh, so yes, thank you so much. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. Sorry. Thank you so much, Julius. So, anyways, um, so please don't take it to any offense, you guys, because I have some people on Instagram like be so offended by the fact that I'm afraid of mosquitoes. Like, I was way. I don't think I've ever seen this many like mosquitoes and bees around me because I wasn't like I lived in a city and never got to live in like a jungle or like I've never been like an outdoorsy kind of person because I was always afraid of like bees. I once got stung by a bee. I would never forget in Venice Beach in California. I was gonna call 911 and I sound so stupid. I know. I'm so sorry. No, but I swear I can't. Like it's just a fear I have. It's well, just a fear. It doesn't matter. We're both in right now. So anyways, um, and just the fact that I'm in the middle of a jungle and when I sleep I can hear the lions roaring and crickets everywhere and stuff. It just really freaks me out that yesterday, like during the day, amazing. Like we're chilling, we're having a great time. Beep, don't move the camera. Yo, oh my ass. I'm like, yeah, it's focused on me and you, baby. Okay. Yeah, it's better than I'm you were in the middle and I was still off to the side. Now we're both in the middle. Okay. Back to what I'm trying to say. Um, what was I saying? So during the day, it's amazing. You know, we go on the game game uh, drives and stuff. And I love it. We get to see the animals. And I'm not as afraid for some reason. Maybe because I'm inside, like, the car. So it's not as scary. Um, but then at night, I don't know what happens to me. Ask him. Last night, I woke up crying in the middle of the night. Shaking. I thought I had a fever. He said I didn't. But I think I did. Um, but it's we did not sleep, and here we are today having coffee. We missed our game night in the morning. Game drive. Game drive. Game night is a movie. Yeah. Game, game drive. So <laughs> we're having coffee right now, and then we're gonna have some lunch, and we are going to head to another game drive. Let me let me summarize everything. She's just blabbing. Let me. Ask you, <laughs> it's a beautiful country. It is. Both the people are amazing. Country, the people are amazing. This is my turn. This is my turn. <laughs> So in Kenya, Kenya is gorgeous. The, the the reason why people come here is because of the tranquility and the hakuna matata. Hakuna matata. Yeah, I know. I and love that. Just the fact that there's nothing to do, and you just sit and look at the jungle and the water, and it's great and it's beautiful. I just saw an eagle fly by us. You know? So I'm having a great time. It really is. It's I crazy. am too. Don't get me. Don't get it twisted, you guys. I am too. I just need to like. all that it offers. Okay, we are heading to our next jungle adventure. Um, and we're about to take this little charter plane to our next destination. Don't put me in, 
This is the best safari we've been in here. Fuck it, relax. We just got here. We can see there and there and there everywhere. <laughs> Alright guys, we just landed! Yay! We are in... What is the place called? Mahali Madhuri. We're in Mahali Madhuri right now. Yeah. Oh, we're not in Mahali. We landed on the airstrip and now we're about to go to Mahali Madhuri. I'm not Masai sure how. Park. Yeah, we're in Masai Mara. Yeah. Guys, as we're landing, like I was looking at the animals like right next to us. They're all around us actually. I'm just wondering, how are we getting to Mahali, Missouri? Because I ain't walking when there's all these wild animals around me. We're surrounded by seven lions. I'm really freaking out.